So now what I want to do now that I've installed the, uh, the valves is I'm going to check the clearance. Uh, and this particular engine, the valve clearance down here is between 0 .004 inches and 0 .010 inches. And I've got my feeler gauge. I actually have 0 .004 all the way through 0 .010. And what I need to do is to put this engine in top dead center position. Right now it's on stroke one, which is the intake stroke. And then now we have the stroke two, which is the compression stroke. And this is top dead center. Now with this being a top dead center, I'm gonna start off by taking my 0 .004. And there's plenty of clearance in there. Let's just bump up to number five, point zero zero five. Still plenty of clearance. What you're feeling for when you put the feeler gauges in there is uh, the ability to get the feeler gauge in there with some drag, a slight drag on there, and not not a lot of drag, but just a little. Again, we still have good clearance on that one so I'll just keep going I just want to make sure that it's not more than the maximum allowed um, we'll try point zero zero seven yeah, it's getting a little tighter but I can still get in there I want number eight. There we go, that's feeling good. Hmm. And well, I'm just going to jump down to, to number ten right away. So you can still get it in there, but there's a lot more drag. So it actually feels pretty good. I'm happy with the results of that. So, so these valves are to spec now. And uh, what I want to do now is to <coughs> remove the flywheel and check the flywheel key to make sure that's okay. So, be right back. 